everyone welcome back to my channel and today i have finally got round to filming my bolt plush collection so all you're gonna see in this video is my bolt teddies basically you know the disney dog which i'm obsessed with so yeah i'm just gonna go ahead and just show you them one by one i'm sorry this may be a long video i'm sorry about that so the first one is again i can't remember what brand which brand etc they are all called so i'm just gonna say bowl or the name of them so this is my claw machine bolt i absolutely love him he is floppy which i absolutely love some i love floppiness and some i don't but the only reason how i know this is claw machine because it says gift prize on the tag so yeah he is in perfect condition with his scar etc so this is um one of i don't know how many bolts but one of are you gonna keep count <laughs> next up i'm going to show you it's the only one on the bed is my talking bolt plus i did have a what was it called another electronic one i had the walking one i sold that one when i needed money i did have another one where his eyes glue red i can't remember what that one called again i sold that one because i needed money for some bills so i don't have as many as i did have purely because you know adult life I need money at times but yeah i absolutely love him so yeah i absolutely love this plus i love how his mouth is like that his expression i love how he's stood um absolutely love him so he's the talking um one one of how many next up i have my sister got me this one. It is, I believe, I want to say Disney World, but I'm not sure if it is Disney World. But a Disney Parks Bolt Plus. Again, I absolutely love his stance. I love that. I love how he's stood. He's a good, strong, firm plush. Again, I absolutely love how vibrant his eyes are. I love how his ears are pinned up. And he is just perfect. And it does say, where is it, the Disney tag there. And then another one there. But he's from the Disney parks, I think. My sister got me him. I have one Christmas or one birthday present. But again, I absolutely love him. Next up, I got this vault. So, someone said he was a pyjama case. But I'm looking at him. And I don't believe he was. Maybe a pencil case. Although it is a weird shape for a pencil case but a pajama case who the hell is going to fit the oh well, i guess a kid but again who's going to fit the pajamas in there i've just stuffed him so he stands and he's a lot firmer but they do do a bigger version of him i did originally want the bigger version but then i thought no because he's not going to fit in my room all these gigantic plushes they're not going to fit in my room when i have a dog in my room as well and a dog bed and dog toys etc etc so i'm happy with the standard size plush he is adorable he's actually one of my favorite vaults so vault is ball in french i'm not sure why but i prefer him to the other vaults i just love his face his eyes they are so cute so i have him <clears throat> i'm not sure if i'm gonna eat yeah um and then i have um which one shall i show you i'll show you this one so again i believe from the disney parks i think or maybe disney store in america i have this laying down bulk plush i absolutely love him he's one of the softest ones i own i absolutely love him who remembers the video i did when i had him on my shoulder like that who remembers the thumbnail for that let me know so i have him he's absolutely adorable again in good condition i absolutely i keep saying it but i absolutely love this version he's one of again one of my favorite versions he's just so soft then i have this tiny disneyland paris plus fern so a lot of people are saying he's a knockoff plush but i have the tag and it looks legit to me again i don't know 
but it does say Disneyland Paris on it and then Euro Disney and then some French words which I'm not even going to try to pronounce because I can't even pronounce English words at times but yeah and a lot of people say he's ugly him ugly no I think He's one of the cutest plushes I own. I absolutely love his tongue sticking out. That is adorable. He's one of the softest bolt plushes I own. And I absolutely love him. He's in need of a wash. Some of these will be going straight in the washer. That's the one thing I hate about white plushes and bolts white. They get dirty and dusty very quickly. Especially as I live at my back garden and my also bedroom window when it's open 9 times out of 10. All the dust and stuff on the backs because we have garages and work right around there and lorries going in and out. So yeah, it gets very dusty up here. But I absolutely love him. I think he's adorable. And again, one of my favourites. I love him. Then let's stick with the other Disneyland Paris version. I absolutely love this one. Yes, I cut mittens off on the side of him. Yes, do I regret it? No, I don't think I do now. I did, but I, I don't know. It does lean to one side a little bit. Not sure how to sort that out. But personally, out of all the bolt plushes I've ever seen and owned, he has the best face of all time. He looks the most realistic, in my opinion. Don't hate me. Don't start arguing in the comments. But personally, I believe he has the most realistic face from the film. I think. And this annoys me, how it doesn't stay flat. That annoys me. He's also called Vault again. But that annoys me how it doesn't stay. So I might have to stitch that in to keep it like that. But yeah, I absolutely love this one. Again, at Disneyland Paris. And again, this one did actually get recalled due to something with his nose. But he's mine forever. I ain't sending him back. I absolutely love him um and then we're going on to the more smaller plushes i do have bigger ones like i said they're on my top shelf i just can't be asked to reach up there today so i'm just trying to grab them all so next up we have your standard medium size dip do it bolt calm down i have this standard medium size bowl so i do actually have two of these no, I, don't. I have three of these. I have two stamped ones and then the re-released one. But I'm only going to show you one because they're more or less exactly the same. But I do have this one. One I purchased years ago. And then one I found in a charity shop and one my mum brought me. No, I found one in a charity shop which my mum brought me. And then the re-released one from Disney. That's it. So I think everyone has seen or own this plus i've seen it sell quite a few times people ask too much money for what it really um worth in my opinion disney stamp there i who misses the disney stamp because i do but yep yeah standard medium disney store plus absolutely love him he is beautiful then i have Another Disney store, I think it's Disney store, yep, Disney store Bolt Plus, which is this one. I mean, they do call this one medium as well, but that ain't large. So, next to medium, I'm going to say, is this um, standing Bolt Plus. Again, I absolutely love him. He is so soft, so cute, and his scar, and this is his scar, no, it's not, it's a lightning bolt, Chloe. What planet are you on? There's his tag. So, yeah, that's the UK version. Look at his ears. I love his floppy ears. They are adorable. And then I'm going to go on. Um, let's leave all my mini ones till last, shall we? So, this one, I believe, is the Toys R Us bowl. But, again, I'm not sure. But it is more or less like the UK Disney Store version but his eyes, they've either been in the sunlight or they've been bleached. I'm pretty sure they haven't been made like that. Or I guess someone has stitched around it, but that would be very hard. But I'm not sure, really. 
I'm guessing someone, I don't know, comparing them, they either stitched them or dyed them so, somehow, haven't they? Looking at it. But yeah, I'm, I absolutely love this purely for the uniqueness of the eyes. I just love him so much. Again, he's so soft, so fluffy. I'm not sure what version he is. He does have a tag. Some of it's faded. Some people say it's the Toys R Us bought, but I'm not going on that because I'm not 100% sure. But there's the tag there. Again, my camera is shite, so it will not focus. But yeah, purely love this for his eyes. And his ears actually stand up, which I absolutely love. So I have him. And then I have the baby bolt in blanket or pouch, as some people say. Oh, he's just so cute, isn't he? I love how on his blanket it actually has mittens and rhino on as well. How adorable is that? I absolutely love him. So I have him. I'll get him out for people who want to see. And there we go. He doesn't actually have bolt on his dog tag, as you can see. But how cute is he? I absolutely love him. So, yep, I have him. Oh, I just love him so much. He is so soft. Unbelievably soft. Then I have one under my foot. I have, um, let's go with this one. I believe this is the older version. I'm not sure. I believe this is the older version of the Disney Store UK Small Plus before they went even smaller. I picked this one up myself years ago. Oh my God, who remembers walking into a Disney store because that was so years ago now. But yeah, I picked, I still actually have the receipt. I mean, you can't see anything on it. It's all faded with the ink. But I picked this one up myself in my local Disney store, Nottingham. But I absolutely love him. And this is the newer UK Disney store version. But look, let me try and get on her head. Look how much smaller they downsized to. I mean, he is still cute. But look how much smaller they downsized to. I'm not sure how to compare them. You can't really tell like that. But yeah, it is so much more smaller than the older ones, which is sad. So I'm going to go on to you next. I have him, the smaller version of the plush. He's so cute. My now the bolt piling bolt pile yeah the bolt pile's just rising. Then I have this movie rewards plush. No idea what movie rewards mean, but yeah, that's him. Um, he doesn't stand very well. I believe, my opinion, he's a bit too squished together. Like he's a bit too thin, so he doesn't stand up properly. But he has his collar and he is super cute, super soft, and I absolutely love him he's so cute um then i have this not official handmade bolt plushy ribbon decoration thing i might actually hang that on my tree now it's christmas i have him got him from a seller on etsy a few months ago then i have my valentine's day vaulty vaulty Balty. <laughs> um, I got him off eBay, I'm going to say a few years ago now, and he did not cost me an arm and a leg. I believe he cost me around 20 to 40 pounds, British pounds. And that's quite cheap compared to how much people want for him now. Um, no, he'll never be for sale, soz. But yeah, he's mine to stay forever. I absolutely love him. He is adorable. Look at him. And look, look. Oh look at him he's got a little love art i absolutely love him everything about this plush screams everything i hate about valentine's day <laughs> but i love him then i have this um i'm gonna say japan it says on tag 110th anniversary um so it's a 110th anniversary plus isn't it I got a, um, it did come with a tag, I cut it off, but obviously I won't reattach if I ever decide to sell him. But I absolutely love him, look at him, he's adorable. So he does look 
similar to like claw machine pluses don't you find at the seaside you know the cheapy one it does look like one of them in the face but I absolutely love him. He's adorable. Look at him. He's so cute. And then I will go on to the Zum Zums. So I have these Zum Zums. So we have this one from 2017. I don't know. The Disney Store Christmas Zum Zum Stocking. Stocking. That's because he's got a stocking in his mouth. Advent calendar. That's the one. So he's got a winter scarf on with a red Christmas stocking. And then we have a plain old bolty there. What oh, wrong way? Like there. So actually, fun fact, this is the exact same Zum Zum as you can see. I cut the scarf off. I wanted the original bolt Zum Zum but couldn't find him anywhere. So I just cut the scarf and the stocking off. Thank you to someone helping me on Instagram for that. So now he just looks like a regular standard bolt, doesn't it? I love him. So I've got them two minis. And then I have this tiny big feet bolt. I absolutely love him. I am still hoping and waiting for a bigger big feet bolt. I absolutely love him. How cute is he? I love him so much. Again from Disney UK. And then I'm not sure where he's from, but I have this mini fluffy bulk keychain plus. But I love him so much. He is adorable. I love him so much. Oh, he's cute. I love him. But again, no idea where he originally came from. But I love his ears. Then I have this Bolt Face 3D Keyring again. I believe this was a handmade item. I believe, I'm not sure. But I absolutely love this. It's not showing very good in camera. I absolutely love this. This is one of my favourite Bolt items again. I love the expression in his face. I love that. And it's just so well made. Whoever made this is very, very talented. And then coming down to the very last item, well, not the very last item because I still have some more bolts up there on my top shelf. So they will be in a part two, look out for that. But for my smaller ones, I have this teeny tiny character bolt. I absolutely love him. He is adorable. I love him so much. And oh my God, he's just cute. I love his little carrot, Mr. Carrot. Oh, he's just adorable. I love him so much. And he concludes the end of my bolt haul. So that is all, well, majority of my bolt plus collection. Um, join me for part two when I show you the bigger ones which I have in my collection. Thank you so much for watching, especially if you don't give any tosh about bolt but just here to watch. That means so much to me. Thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up. Let me know if you collect ball. Let me know if you enjoy the film. Um, and I will see you all in my next video.